something that suits them. Without question, I think it's a very important observation to draw those three key themes together. Uh, as, uh, as one of the speakers was saying, it's very key that we figure out how to connect human beings, and, and art is significant to that. So as we look at the recovery, it's important that we find out how to express ourselves. So art is very important. Do I ever believe there are intersections in art, mental health, and recovery? I think uh, it's become very obvious that art plays such an important role in just about everything that touches so many people and so many ways. Well, uh, uh, without question, uh, you know, uh, giving, uh, giving children, uh, adults, and really our seniors opportunities to express themselves uh, through art, art as uh, being uh, therapeutic uh, for us, and uh, really supporting uh, mental health, uh, whether it's, uh, uh, you know, strong wellness concepts of mental health, or whether it's dealing with uh, mental health as an illness. Uh, uh, the, the psychosis and, uh, and, 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 and the very uh, challenging aspects of having uh, strong mental health. There's no question that uh, today, I believe, began a conversation that will provide uh, better, better results. I think people will go from here today and have a better understanding of our intersecting with mental health and recovery because we also need to realize that uh, recovery is a is an ongoing process. Uh, there there are you know there aren't cures uh, for bipolar uh, schizophrenia, uh, but rather people move into a, re a state of recovery. Sometimes for very long periods, other times uh, shorter. Uh, so I think art in that context can be truly beneficial and of value uh, to a stronger, healthier person. Absolutely. Uh, I think there are intersections. Although today, I think one of the things that really uh, struck me was a comment made about creativity, uh, not just art. Maybe art is too limiting. Uh, when I'm standing here at the community college, and it's not all just about art, it's, it's about um, we have a lot of people who study different trades and technologies, and uh, art can seem a little distant to them, but if we talk about creative, processes and creativity that can be very uh, I think more tangible for them and I think it would help them in that intersection concept. Yes, I didn't need to hear the conversation to know that. I hope that it came across that um, the artists are a, a wonderful resource for our better health. And let's leave the word recovery out. We heard that that's a bit of a stereotype word. But for our greater thriving, we didn't hear the word thriving today, for our greater thriving as a society. It's nothing to do with physical illness or mental illness or them or us or whatever. It's to do with our whole society. We're all, you know, mentally challenged. Psychological challenge art is a fantastic resource that is so under undervalued. And that's my answer really that we need to bring art right into the forefront however we can however we can do that. That's my response. Well the short answer is Yes, I think there have always been. Um, as I said, I, I have a bit of a problem with the idea of recovery. Because I don't think that recovery is always in the cards for, for everybody. And I don't like the idea that um, there's a failure. If, if, um, if, if an arts intervention um, in mental health uh, doesn't lead you know, to recovery. It's still worthwhile well, doing it. You're wrong. Um, 
I think the whole idea of, of using art um, for uh, people living with mental illness is a chance for them to uh, express their work experience of culture. And that maybe is as important as, as the actual. <coughs> I think we need to stop thinking about those as separate issues and that I look forward to the day when integration of what we know makes us human, art, music, social networks, all these things which are so fundamental to our existence Thanks again. are just part of what we do all the time okay. and that when we look at addressing other things such as a mental illness. We had those things on top of, not instead.